I'm back from hibernation. Ow. Hey. It's me. I'm back. And it's March? That seems about right for my... My punctuality. Uh, yeah. So, I don't know if you noticed, but it's 2018. And, uh... Yeah, I've been away. As, as per usual. Uh, I've been pretty a pretty busy boy but also a pretty sad boy but not anymore so we're just gonna get into that stuff about 2017 and then move on to the more important stuff that's happening more recently okay cool so for me uh, 2017 kind of ended pretty poorly you know not not great could have been better um, yeah it was kind of this situation where uh Things just kind of piled up and got worse and worse, and I was just in a really kind of a bad headspace. The uh, the last half, not last half, like last quarter of uh, 2017. Um, and yeah, I kind of let a, let a lot of things get to me, and that kind of made things worse. And then through the beginning of 2018 it kind of lingered and uh, I just really wasn't having a good time I was I was stressed out about what I was doing uh, with the channel I guess and just everything else life wise and uh, yeah I basically ended up worse off financially at the end of 2017 than at the uh, beginning which is not good it's bad so some of it was kind of my fault given that I went to some conventions, but that's because I am dumb or not and prioritize seeing friends and people over <laughs> financial stability. Whoops! I should probably kind of cut back on that for this year, unfortunately. Sorry, friends. I need to not starve. Anyway, yeah. So that's kind of all over with now. I'm, I'm feeling better. I'm working on some fun stuff. Um started I'm waking up good I'm waking up early I start I started doing exercises pushing stuff and pulling stuff. I've I have not improved uh, talking to a camera that is that is obvious anyway yeah so 2017 was kind of bogus but it's done now and it is March so I should shut up about it and get on with the rest of the stuff now let's get into the important things I'm just gonna go to my list of stuff talk about because I can't remember for shit oh yeah so recently I, I released another well I mean I didn't release it but another animation that I made was released on Dan Bull's channel it was a music video that I was talking about a while ago um, and if you've seen it you probably know it's not very happy uh, yeah that was a, that was an interesting one and it was kind of a little odd because that was I was working on that one during the time where I was having a bad time and uh, so yeah working on that kind of project with a, it was in a bad headspace doesn't really help but I don't think it, it did anything and um, yeah it was more so just like other things that were causing me to be stressed and sad anyway yeah so, but I'm I don't regret working on it because I think it came out really well and um, the, uh, the comments that it's getting is, is pretty incredible. Seems to be resonating with a lot of people, and um, I'm, I can, can't be anything but glad about that, and I hope, I hope it means something to those people, and I hope they're doing okay. I'm very vague and bad with feely things, so yes, that's all I gotta say. I'm just glad uh, Dan was happy with it. We kind of, he just kind of came to me with the, the song, for it and um, I wrote I wrote something up and then we went back and forth on it a bit and then came up with the little story that takes place in the, uh, the uh, music video and I think it came out really well and I'm happy with it so that's that that was the most recent project I did that was the last one of 2017 and I finished it's done and it's over with and it's good and sad but still good yay another thing speaking of projects uh, that that were from 2017 do you remember those those weird clips in my demo reels that you didn't know came from like this one and and this one 
Well, that was the, the, the intro credits for the indie movie Deviant that I talked about, like, in January. Movies take a long time to make. Um, yeah, but that, that is, they're pretty much done with the indie movie. Like, because I, I, it was the opening credits that I animated for the full fe feature length indie movie. Um, and they're on their last leg of the thing, and they've got some extra, like a Kickstarter, you know? It's it's not Kickstarter, it's, seed, it's called Seed and Spark, but it's, it's, it's a Kickstarter-esque page where they're just getting some last minute things for like VFX and music just to get that sorted. So I'm gonna plug it and help them out because they're very nice and, and I helped them with their intro credits. So yeah, I'm gonna put that in the description. And another thing that they came to me with was they're gonna be doing a special little giveaway thing specifically for this channel because um, Obviously the intro credits are stop-motion and they have felt puppets of the two main characters and and Yeah, I made those so what they're doing is they're giving away 18 Little sets of trading cards just for like a little fun thing So they've got, they've got the two main characters on screen right now, and then there's another card that is me And there's gonna be 18 sets of those uh so what the, the giveaway is, is just, you have to, um, okay. So the, so the criteria for the giveaway are as follows. So one, uh, you just gotta donate to the, the, uh, the funding page. It doesn't have to be much, it can be like the lowest tier if you, if you want. Yeah. Um, then when that happens, you will receive a thank you email from the crew of the movie, thanking you for your donation. And once that happens, you reply to that email with a secret word. And the secret word is Starship. That's all you gotta do. So there's only 18 slots for that, and that's gonna be the only cards ever. So yeah, if that sounds interesting, do that. Or just donate and share the funding anyway, and don't do that, <laughs> but I don't know, you get something out of it if you do that. Yeah, so that's that. So, donate to the page in the description. They'll give you an email saying thank you, and then you reply to that email with Starship. And then you will get cards. Fun! Okay, so those are the two finished projects already. Um, now on to more stuff about my channel, I guess. Considering, once again, going back to the having a bad time at the end of 2017 thing. Um, yeah, I'm kind of switching gears a little bit with the channel, but it's not going to really be noticeable. It's more just going to be like on my end, my mentality toward it. To <laughs> my mentality towards it uh, being that I'm pretty sure... YouTube is not for me in the sense that it's gonna be any kind of living and it never has been um, it because I'm an, I'm an animator did you know I do that yeah and and YouTube doesn't like those still um, well in the sense that what I do takes months of time for one video and it's usually only two minutes long not good doesn't doesn't really pay off in the way in the in the literal way <laughs> pay off huh. um, it's it's not it's not like I'm saying I'd only do it if I was getting paid uh, well my own stuff obviously it's the fact that I can't really do it unless I'm getting paid because I can't really go a month and a half without some kind of you know support <laughs> and um, unfortunately I don't feel comfortable having that support if I'm not doing something monthly. So where that goes is, if, in case you didn't know, I had a Patreon, um, and I just wasn't updating it. Well, I wasn't. I was updating it, but I wasn't releasing anything, um, and I didn't feel like the Patreon was justified because of that. So I went ahead and, and closed that up. Um, so yeah. 
that's a thing. I'm kind of on my own now, which is fine, I think, because then I can kind of just focus on, you know, having this being my job, I should get, you know, my living from actually doing work for other people, like, you know, Jack and Mark, those kinds of things, and, you know, the the opening credits of the Deviant movies is a blink description. <laughs> um, yeah. So I think I'll be able to feel like I'm doing more professional stuff with it being like only only based on actually doing things for people rather than um, having YouTube also and vaguely attempting to keep it up uh, from people's help. And it's not like I'm ungrateful or anything. I'm definitely grateful. I wouldn't have made a lot of the things I did make if it wasn't for the Patreon support. So thank you all out there who were a part of that. Like, definitely. Thank you. I'm gonna put all your names at the end of the video as a final thanks. Yes. Um, so that being said, since I don't have a Patreon, there have been people who were asking other ways to support me. So thanks for that don't have to do that um but yeah i do finally i can talk about it because i haven't made a video because it was remember how i was sad <laughs> i got new shirts and stuff and mugs and stuff it's all the same but it's on it's on t public link in the description and here's the new shirts that i've made wow they're so okay so yeah, new newish shirts from the last time I mentioned merch, which was like over a year ago. Um, quick, quick, quick note: I'm gonna be probably getting rid of this one since I kind of updated my logo a little bit. Um, so if you want that one, it's probably gonna go away soon. Just, just click, just so you know. So yeah, there's that. It's got the shirts and the mugs and the sweaters and all that stuff. All in the same place, same place, same place. So yeah, it's gonna be T Public slash store slash Cranbusher if you're interested, and I would appreciate it because it would help me. Thanks. Also, music, because I still make that, and you can buy it on Bandcamp. And also, another note: my hair is like a bowl today. I'm sorry. I look 12. I made a new channel a little while back called Toonbursher, where I'm gonna be putting all the music I make instead of just like releasing everything on one channel because I feel like it was kind of getting a little jumbly. Whereas like this randomly after a month I'll just release one song and it's kind of, kind of, I feel like it's kind of let down after being gone for so long. So yeah, instead I'm just gonna release it all on Toonbursher. So if you if you enjoy my music and and you, you you enjoy it, it's over there. And it's also all the videos are ad free, so there's kind of no interruptions. But if you if you want to buy it, to help me out. That'd be appreciated. <laughs> Thanks. Um, yeah, that's all that stuff out of the way. So new shirts and stuff if you really want them. Um, and new music channel if you really want that as well. It's nice and pink and pretty. Wow. So I think that's all the uh, updates I had. Sorry I've been gone for so long. Um, I hope to be here more, honestly, because, you know, back in the day, in case any of you are still here from like 2015, if you are, what are you doing? Go away. Don't go away, unless you really want to go away. <laughs> But yeah, um, yeah. Back then, I was kind of a lot more active because uh, I was doing more things besides animation. I was doing video game stuff and comment stuff, which I still kind of do occasionally. But yeah, it it gen generally felt more connected in a way. You know what I what I mean? Like there was more interaction back and forth because I was making more stuff and I was generally here more. Um, and it I've, it's kind of gotten away from me which sucks because then I kind of pop in every six months um, I don't know so I don't know I kind of want to uh, do a bit more of that maybe some more comments I don't know I don't want to promise anything because I am very busy right now working on the next animation 
So I don't want to say I'm going to do something and then not be able to do it. But yeah, that's what I'd like to do. I'm definitely going to be making a vlog for the next PAX, PAX East, because I'm going to that. And I'm going to be making a video on that. It's going to be fun. That's kind of the thing I'm going for for, for this channel, is I'm going to do things that are fun for me, and also things that won't destroy my my wallet. Good, good philosophy. So yeah, I'm going to be doing that, because honestly I find it fun to do, because I do like editing, and I don't really get to do a lot of editing, because uh, projects usually take couple months to animate and then the editing process is like only three days or at most a week and that feels like no time at all so yeah I'd like to just edit more videos and stuff but yeah that's all I guess already done but yeah so I, I hope to see you soon and uh, I hope you stick around because got a lot of cool stuff Next, the next animation, I think, is, is going to be my absolute favorite. And I'm collaborating on it with... That one! Foolish Kia! I wore her shirt in this video to bother her! <laughs> yeah, um, we're, we're collaborating on the next one, and it's... So far, I'm very excited about it. And if you can see behind me, um, or you follow me on Twitter, uh, you probably already know what it is, but yeah. I'm excited. So that's it. That's all I got. So thanks, thanks for watching, and take care. That's what I say. Bye. <laughs>